Uh, welcome to Watford Musa. What does it mean to you to be here? Thank you very much. Uh, what does that mean for me? Uh, I feel very proud and happy to, to be here. Uh, they, they did everything to, to convince me to, to, to stand here. And uh, yeah, so we had a long discussion together. And uh, I think everything was, uh, was, uh, was good. So we had a good chat. And uh, that's why I decided to, to, to join this club. How pleased are you to be reuniting with your former Tottenham teammate, Danny Rose? Yeah, I'm very, I'm very happy and pleased to, yeah, to be with him again. Uh, he's a very good friend, and we, we had a lot of years together in uh, in Tottenham. So to meet him again at Watford, so yeah, I could not ask better teammate than than that. So it will help me to to settle down in the with the team, with all the squad, and hopefully we're gonna have some uh, some great great years all together. Did you speak to Danny at all before coming here? Yeah, I spoke with him a little bit, so I was asking him some, uh, some, uh, some things about, about Watford. So he, he told me a lot of positive things and uh, that has helped me to, to make the choice to, to sign for, for Watford. Of course, you're good friends with Etienne Capou as well, who you played with uh, at Toulouse in France. How close are you with Etienne? Yeah, I know very well Etienne uh, because we were at the academy together in France. Then uh, we played professional in Toulouse, so yeah, we were very, very close. Then uh, after, you know, in football, you everyone go away and he had his family, so it was difficult to to see him. But uh, sometimes we we trying to have some uh, some news, and uh, yeah, so he's a good friend of mine. So we had some great years together. Now he's, he's in Spain, so I can see he's enjoying his football there, and I'm very happy for him. So. I'm going to try to, to do the same uh, with Watford. You played more than 200 times for Tottenham. What are your favourite memories from your five years there? Yeah, I played a lot of games and I had a, a, a lot of good memory there. And if I have to, to, to remember one game, I would say the, maybe the semi-final of the uh, Champions League. It was an amazing game and I think everyone remember of that day. So this will be the, the best game in my, in my memory. How proud were you to be named in the Champions League squad of the season during that run to the final two years ago? Ah, uh, yeah, it was uh, amazing because, uh, you know, when you're a kid, what you want, what I wanted is to be a professional, try to, to play the best competition in the world and uh, to play the Champions League and, and live my dream was uh, uh, something special for me. And uh, to be part of this team was uh, uh, incredible and I tried to, to enjoy all, all the time I was on the pitch and uh, it will be something I will never, never forget. Was it a difficult decision for you to leave Tottenham? Of course, uh, especially when you, you spend a lot of years in the, for, for one club and I had some, uh, some good friends, uh, I knew everyone at the club and everyone was nice uh, with me. But like I said, uh, we know in football, one day uh, you will have to to to, to go, and uh, you don't know when. And uh, now is the time for for me. So uh, I live with the two feelings. First one is uh, because I I'm not uh, gonna be with some amazing people, but at the same time because I, I did my best with this club, and I have no regret, and I have some great time. So and now it's time for me to to move on and and open a, a new chapter with, uh, with my new team. Did you have interest from other clubs? And if so, why did you choose Watford? Yeah, uh, I spoke with some, some teams, but uh, like I said to you before, uh, I had a talk with Watford during uh, many weeks. And uh, I think for me and my, my family, so it was uh, the best option for, for me to, to come here. And uh, I wanted to stay in, uh, in Premier League, so everything was, uh, was here to, yeah, to accept uh, and play for Watford, so I'm very happy and proud to, to be here now. What qualities do you hope to bring to the squad here? Uh, I'm, I'm going to try to bring my my qualities is to play to well, try to, to work hard, try to yeah, to to push the team forward, trying to, to bring my experience and uh, 
like you said, I play many games in Premier League and I play a lot of games with uh, the French national team also. So uh, everything I can bring to, to the team will be, I think, will be benefit for, for us. And uh, yeah, just play my own game. Uh, if they sign me, it's because they know what I can bring to the, to the team. And I'm going to try to bring that first and after trying to, to bring something else if, if I can. You've played right across the midfield during your career, but is there a part of the pitch that you feel suits you best? Yeah, since I since I've started, I play uh, at uh, many many positions. But like I always said, uh, my, for me, my best position is a centre midfielder. But after, uh, is a manager who decide where to play, and sometimes you have to do it for 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 the team. So the manager prepares some uh, some tactic and. Uh, if he decides to, to put you on the side or in the middle or, or at the back is for something specific maybe and you, you need to try to, to do your best. So again, my best position for me and where I feel more comfortable is in, in the middle. But uh, for the team and for the club, I will, I will play anywhere and everywhere and try to, to do my best. You've played 70 times for France, including at the Euros just a couple of months ago, and this is your 10th season in the Premier League. So you come with a lot of experience, but how hungry are you to achieve even more? Yeah, I've played many years in the, in the Premier League, but I, I came here with, uh, with a lot of uh, desire to, to win games, trying to, to win trophies if we can, try, trying to, to bring this club higher, and uh, yeah, trying to achieve a lot of things. I'm 32 years old, but uh, my legs are still fresh. And uh, I hope uh, all the team uh, will go in the, in the same direction and try to, to perform every week. Uh, we know a season is tough, but you need to try to be consistently every game. And uh, hopefully at the end of the season, we, we will all be happy. Click here for more videos.